edges. So normally if I move over an edge and I click, and I start dragging it, I'm going to be constrained, usually on one of the axes, uh, which is going to limit how I can move so that I don't overly distort the geometry. So right now I did, I did not hit an arrow key to constrain my movements. I'm just moving my, my cursor in a circle. You can see it's only moving back and forth. That is because something called autofold, we have it down here in the toolbar. See, I'm on Mac, so it says the modifier key for me is command equals toggle autofold. Autofold is turned off right now, so it's not going to let me fold up or change the geometry. If I do tap that modifier key, now I can move it in any direction and distort this geometry however I want. You can see as I move it over this way, it does cause that front face to break. So I have two faces there instead of one. If I come back here, slide this way. So you can see that's what autofold does. If autofold is turned on, I can move this anywhere I want. If autofold is, is not turned on, then I am limited to movements that don't break the connected faces.